Hello and welcome to this week's edition of Pinterest in Real Life. I'm your host, Jay Abeda. This is the weekly show in which a DIY noob recreates Pinterest pins. This week we're making coasters out of uh, just Sharpie art. Um, it's a really simple project. All you need to pick up are a couple tiles from like the hardware store. Uh, I got mine for about 80 cents, 88 cents. Um, you need a few of those. You need some Sharpies. Ideally, the thicker ones, the better. Um, varying colors. Uh, you need some rubbing alcohol and then um, some Mod Podge and some kind of uh, like foam or cork board in order to put on the bottom so they don't slide around or scrape anything up on your table. Um, it's a really simple project so let's just go ahead and get started. <laughs> What you need to do is just cover the Sharpie, drawing all over in different places with different colors. Um, try to cover most of the area so that the colors are more vibrant. Um, the darker colors I notice seem to work a little better. drop some of the drops of isopropyl alcohol, rubbing alcohol, onto the, the sharpie area. That'll make it to spread out and kind of blur, and that's what kind of gives that watercolor effect. Um, you don't want to use too much because then it'll spread out too much and more looks like a, like a ground survey than it does like the watercolor, but it still kind of looks cool. I like the way that that looks um, just as much as I like the, the darker one, the, 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 the richer colors. seal it. Um, I recommend like a spray sealant first and I can see why I put the after I put the Mod Pod on even with the spray sealant a little bit came up. So a spray sealant kind of seals it down um, without spreading any of the, the ink. After that you just use Mod Podge and pull it on between like three and five layers. I think I did four. They feel pretty pretty thick and I don't think anything's going to bleed through at this point. whatever foam or cork or whatever you're using on the bottom, just glue, hot glue, super glue, whatever you need to, to attach it. Mine kind of sticks already, but I just, so I just use some Elmer's glue um, just to, to seal it up all the way. And voila, project's done. So that's it for this week's edition of Pinterest in Real Life. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. I would appreciate that. Uh, if you have any ideas for future projects, go ahead and leave them down in the comments below. Um, anything you want to see me do or that you've seen on Pinterest, you can also follow me on Pinterest and send me pins via that way. And uh, I'm interested in anything that doesn't cost a bunch of money that's not totally outside of my means. So uh, send anything your way. Um, I do videos every single Friday, so I will see you next week. Bye.